Finally sent away there, the first section of the 800 meters for class 3 boys. Looks like Swaby of Titchfield on the inside, certainly doing some good running. Blake of St. Elizabeth Technical also traveling well too, the gentleman from Kono College Street. He's also moving as well for the top two at the moment. Titchfield, Swaby and St. Elizabeth Technical's Pullman Blake. Looks to be Magatis Brown also traveling there. And the gentleman from Kingston College, that's Anderson, in the top four. So Magatis Brown, Jaden Brown, doing some traveling. He's right behind St. Elizabeth Technical's Blake in anticipation of the bell lap. So Jaden Brown of Magatis. Another plate of steps. Casey Anderson in third position. Alfonso Davis is Hopkins. And Campion is Facey. But the one to be caught, Jaden Brown of Magatti, still out front on the back stretch with the lead. Kingston College's Christopher Anderson now making his way up to second position. Alfonso Davis is Hopkins also. Doing some work, he's now in third position. Almost at the 200 meters mark, however, Jaden Brown of Magatti still holding on to that lead. Kingston College is Anderson doing some work there on the curb. The leader, no foul target. Francis Davis is Hopkins still hanging on to third. Brown of Magatti still holding on to that lead. But Anderson of Kingston College still doing some work there to try and catch him. As they come into the straightaway, Stasis Blake also hanging on to that third position. Jaden Brown of Magatti holding on to the lead. Casey's Anderson has some work to do, but he will not catch Jaden Brown of Magatti. Flash time 2 minutes 05 for 39 seconds. Second place going to Casey's. Christopher Anderson, the third, Alfonso Davis is Hopkins. The time for Brown of Magadi, two minutes, zero five point four three seconds. Two minutes. Oh, I usually go and broke the record if you ask me. There goes section two of the 800 meters for class three boys. Thompson from Jamaica College traveling well, so to the gentleman from Magatti, that's Honeygun. So Thompson and Campbell of JC present very much. However, the leader early is Honeygun of Magatti. So as they come into the straightaway there, Magatti is Honeygun still holding on to that lead. Reed of William Nib. In second position at the moment, and the duo from Jamaica College is also there. Camperdowns, Saunders, doing some work too. Campbell of Jamaica College present there as well, but Magatti certainly stamping dominance so far in the 800 meters. Brown taking section one. And Honeygun well, of Magatti leading the, the 50, in section two. Even the 50 flat and burn out. You're sending to the goal. You're sending to so the goal. So Honeygun of Magatti with the lead. You're sending to the goal. Chasing him is Aldean Reed of William Neighbor. Camper down Daniel Saunders in third position. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Campbell of JC in fourth at the moment. But still holding on to that lead. Akeem Honeygun of Magatti. Closing in on him, Aldean Reed of William Neighbor. So as they prepare to come into the straightaway, Magadis Honeygun holding on to the lead. Reed of William Neighbor chasing. Camperdown Saunders also doing some work. He's chasing Reed of William Neighbor. The gentleman from Magadi holding on to that lead is Honeygun. And Honeygun will cross the finish line first. William Neighbor's Reed. 
But coach, I know that's so impressive enough. 50 for the, for the 400. 50 for the 400. Send him a 400. Two minutes, zero, one point seven six seconds. Two minutes, zero, one point seven six seconds. The winning time there for Akeem Bunnigan. In fact, putting him so far at the top of the table. We will pass this time so far between the two sections. But we have three more sections to go. That was section two of five. We're asking in the meantime for the competitors for the class one launch. And two or one. Quinella in the bag. Calabar's Watts now, so doing some work too. Watts of Clarendon College also very present in the mix. Powell of Magaty, advancing well also. Less than 200 minutes Johnson and Anderson. No, no. It's a No, no, no. Allen. So what's up, Calabar now making his way up? Second position, he's chasing. John Snow, Edwin Allen. So on the back stretch, they are John Snow, Edwin Allen. Definitely have to put in the work to hold on to that lead as Watson of Calabar is certainly advancing diligently towards him. Watson of Clarendon College in third position. And look at the curve, ladies and gentlemen. John Snow of Edwin Allen being chased there by Watson of Calabar. They're about to come into the straightaway. And the gentleman from Calabar on the heels of John Snow of Edwin Allen. He is showing the dominant speed here. So Watson of Calabar taking the lead away from Johnson of Edwin Allen. So Javel Watson of Calabar, 10 2 minutes, 10.89 seconds. So Javel Watson of Calabar, 2 minutes, 10.89 seconds, followed by Johnson, 2 minutes, 13. For six four seconds, and uh, that's Johnson of the Edwin Allen. Watson there for third, two minutes, nineteen point seven three seconds. <laughs> Um, sends them away there. The outside Jones of Kingston College Jones somewhere. Maggot is well, trying to sprint away from the field. The pitch fields, Burgess Richards also there. But look at the Maggot gentleman, that's Theodore Rowe. Certainly trying to roll away from the rest of the track. The gentleman from Kingston College does some work. That's Jones of KC and Papa Downs Mingo. We have some work to do. So Theodore Rowe of Magaty with the advantage as he comes into the straightaway preparing for the bell nap. 
So Pedro Roy and Malati certainly looking tall and comfortable at the moment. Camperdown's Mingo being passed now by Jones of Kingston College as the ball up in series. A cover of Sydney Pig and also in the mix too. The one to be caught. Pedro Roy of Malati. Yeah, man, I'm third, man. In second position, and on his heels, Jeremy Jones of Kingston College. Right behind Joe, and his brother of Sydney Pagan. Yeah, yeah, God, really get that. Now it comes down to this on the back stretch. We're seeing Roy of Malady slowing somewhat. But Bayer coming to advance is Jeremy Jones of Kingston College. Sydney Pagan's brother of Kingston College. As Pedro Roy of Malady slows on the back stretch. So brother of Sydney Pagan and Jones of Kingston College. There looks to be... Williams of St. Jago. Also doing some work as well as they passed Malatis Royal. A gentleman in green and gold from Ravensworth making his way to the top. But challenging him now is Luke Plummer of Sydney Pagan. So St. Jago and Sydney Pagan, the contest is hot. Sydney Pagan's plumber is right there pulling away. So plumber of Sydney Pagan pulling away from Williams of St. Jago. So Luke Plummer of Sydney Pagan getting it. 2 minutes 17.69 seconds for him. Second is Ajani Williams of St. Jago. 2 minutes 18.74 seconds. I said my way go on. Okay. One game there, put it. Oh, oh, oh. Finally sent away near the final section of the 800 meters for class three boys. Richards of St. Jago, making his way to the top early. Brooks of Alfonso Davis also there with him. And Chamberlain of Kingston College, sealing out the top three. Calabar Spam also doing some work there on the back stretch. Now looking to pass, or has passed rather, Chamberlain of Kingston College. So St. Jago's Richards holding on to the lead ahead of Brooks of Alfonso Davis and Calabar's Palmer. So Calabar's Palmer now neck and neck with Brooks of Alfonso Davis. In fact, Calabar is now slightly ahead as the battle lap is about to start. St. Jago's Richards still holding on to that lead, diligently making his way ahead. It's Calabar's Palmer. So Palmer of Calabar now with the advantage on the back stretch. In fact, he's pulling away from the gentleman from St. Jago. So on the back stretch with the lead. Alejandro Palmer of Calabar. Just about 200 meters remaining for this one. It's the final section of the 800 meters for class three boys. Green and black is leading the track. So Alejandro Palmer of Calabar making his way home. St. Jago's Richards slowing even more as Brooks of Alfonso Davis now snatches the second position. For the clear leader, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Alejandro Palma of Calabar, diligently advancing towards the finish line, and he will take the finish for section five. Two minutes, two, four, four, one, two seconds, the flash time. Only two minutes, zero, four, four, one, six seconds for Palma of Calabar. And the time win. Yes, sir. Finish where you start. And he does so. So that brings to an end of the 800 meters for class three boys.